Hey there, it's James once again, and today I have a very interesting mortar to show you, which is called the Magnosphere. It roughly rotates around 50 to 100 RPM, so it's not very fast, and it's otherwise known as a Mendocino levitating motor. And basically the rotor levitates uh, over top of these bearing magnets. And obviously this has an array of linear magnets around a sphere looking shape, which I will never be able to pronounce. <laughs> But let's take a closer look and how this actually works. So as I uncover the solar panel here, you'll see it hooked up to a extra battery. And then in the middle here is an electromagnet, which is controlled by a Hall sensor. And basically how the Hall sensor works is that when a magnet comes close to it, it's triggered by the magnetic field. So it will turn on whatever device it's hooked to and in this case, it's the electromagnet. The electromagnet pushes the magnet away and the Hall sensor turns off. And this process repeats itself for every magnet in this contraption. Unlike other Mendocino motors, which have everything incorporated in the actual motor, which is levitating, this one has the components underneath. And apparently with the setup, it will rotate for weeks on end without charging, but I haven't tested that out yet. The Hall sensor is a very important component in a lot of different things, including motors, ignition timing, and engines, and even anti-lock braking. There are no moving parts, so they are very redundant with high electron mobility. Materials such as gallium, indium, and graphene make up the sensor. The idea of a light commutated motor was first described by Daryl Champion in 1962. And eventually, Larry Sprain developed a real working motor in 1994. The name Mendocino comes from the location of his workshop on the Mendocino coast of California. But you'll likely never see this motor power anything substantial as a direct electric conversion from the solar cells is probably more efficient. So once again, thanks for watching. Please like the video if you enjoyed it and also make sure to subscribe to my channel.